if you are a working professional the most convenient option is an h1 so far so normally you decide to go abroad you go to a consultant pay them some fee and they process your h1 application by the time that type process is done you need roughly 12 months before you go abroad and then the company that sponsored you will start finding a job for you put you on the page and it will take 3 to 4 months for them to find your job and place you. so relocating to us to the common h1 method is a 16 month process Number one, it takes 16 months of planning, and number two, the success rate is 30 percent. So most people who want to go end up not going in one year. They will need three to four years of training, reworking, reapplying before they can make them. UGTX and Turing Mates have designed a F1 route that makes the process a lot better. Number one, because it's a university program, you can decide three times a year. It's not just February or March. We have three terms. You can apply in all three terms. Secondly, the way we design, you complete your coursework in year one, and then you go abroad. you have one year to do your cpt do the right internships and then at the end of that you get a masters degree and then you have three years of opt when you can have someone apply for your h1 the work so you get four years of ability to work without an h1 through the easy beats and secondly during the second year when you are in us After you complete the course, you can go there. You have one whole year to find your internships um, and jobs, and you can work full time there. So you can plan your career in a very good field, in a very satisfactory way, through the F1 route and not H1 route. And the last advantage, the success rate of H1 is roughly 30 percent. Success rate of F1 is 80 percent if you don't have internship. And 90 percent or more if you have an internship. So three times a year at 90 percent success you can go. So the whole plan you have more or less 100 percent certainty that in a year you are in US. If you are a working professional, you enroll in the UGDX program to make it easy for you. We handle the programs during the weekend, so you don't have to resign your job. During that time, once you get your admission, you go and apply for your visa. After that year, once you land there, you enroll in the program where ninety-five percent of the work is internship. So you will start looking for internships, and you will get. What is even better is we already partner with several companies that are excited about recruiting these interns. In fact, some of our partners want to. I will you in India and give you a conditional offer letter of internship by the time you land in the US. So the day you go to the visa interview, you have a paid internship offer with you, which makes getting the visa a lot more easy. You can do it. Master's programs are in full stack artificial intelligence and machine learning. These digital technologies are currently Amongst the highest demand and highest pay bracket, anyone with an engineering degree or a master's degree uh, who is working should be eligible for this. If you want to study full time, you don't have a job, you want to study full time, you are also eligible, and we have a full time program. The way we design your program. You spend as little as three lakh rupees for your year one education when you don't have the visa. Majority of your fee, which is roughly fifteen thousand dollars, what is left, you pay only after you land in USA. But by then, you 
if you are selected to our partners, you have an internship that pays you $2,000 a month. So, it is very easy to get loans for that kind of an amount and it's very easy for you to pay it with an internship and in fact you will end up saving. Once you join the program, in six months you will get your I-20 with which you can start applying for your F1 visa. And let's say you didn't get your visa in your first attempt. We extend your offer lateral entry by one year, which means you earned already 50% of the credits. You can then take one year, many more attempts to get your visa and come after a year and pursue again exactly the same way the program. So you will get multiple attempts to apply for your visa and you will pay majority of the fee only after you land in the US. This makes it both financially and opportunity wise extremely attractive for a working professional to get into US. The success rate of an F1 with a fully paid internship is as low as 90%. So very few people don't get the visa in the first attempt. Those who do not get, we will place them in our partners' Indian offices at a very attractive salary and give them a one-year extension to uh, new employ. So you will have a job in India that pays you really well and you will get several attempts before you can actually go abroad. If you are a working professional who want to relocate to US, this is one of the best options that you should consider. Thank you.